Okay, Menorca Navy, here we go. Quick report from Richmond Hill, Georgia. Uh, this is back over at the Live Oak Complex uh, off Highway 17. Uh, water is really beginning to recede here. You can really see the difference uh, from even just yesterday, uh, how much the water has is, is come down. Most of the garages that were in here were uh, still still uh, with water yesterday. We can see now that it's beginning to fall here on this side. And this is good news for residents. It looks as if this water level uh, will probably begin to get out of here pretty quick. From what we've seen over on the other side, it's really starting to drop quickly. And this is just a process of the ground uh, being able to absorb the water and it finally being able to, to drain out into uh, the river basin of the Ogeechee. Folks are still dealing with a little bit of water coming in here in the entrance that's kind of deep, but that is, is quickly going away. Now, over in the Richmond Place subdivision, people were beginning to start the demolition process, getting everything out of these garages that were compromised. Um, we saw multiple residents where they've already started uh, cutting the sheetrock, the drywall material, getting the insulation out, and, and then uh, saw one resident who was uh, treating the, uh, the wood in there with uh, probably bleach. That's usually usually the... The process you want to make sure you get something on that on that wood that's gotten wet to prevent uh, any of uh, any of mold or mildew growing inside that wall uh, then let it dry out and start start the process of, of patching up the drywall um, but we didn't see any of these streets holding water this is a great sign there's still um, a little bit of water weeping down along the edges of the road, but for the most part, the streets were were dry in this subdivision, and that's good news, but the work is just beginning. Tremendous amount of work ahead for these residents to um, straighten out the damage that's been caused uh, from this flooding incident here in South Georgia. We did notice that the emergency management command post was no longer uh, on site. It's been moved and across the street in that parking lot uh, that was uh, flooded yesterday is beginning to dry out. This is a good sign. There's still a lot of homes that have water in them over on the south side of Highway 144 back down in this area. Um, but it's, it's obvious now that the water level in here is beginning to drop. Now, U.S. Highway 17 was still closed, heading north out of Richmond Hill. Uh, hopefully, this highway can get reopened uh, very soon. Hey, that's all we got. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't, and you guys be safe out there.